greatly enjoyed Scott through the years. Of course, uh, I'm not quite sure how many years ago uh, he started coming to children's church and Sunday school and all those things. And of course, his mom uh, was baptized just a couple months ago, a few months ago, uh, and uh, talked to Scott about baptism and such as that. Of course, the first question is, are you saved? And so Scott uh, explained that last summer at uh, camp, he received Christ as his Savior. Uh, through that time, uh, he's talked about baptism, and we finally got around to talking about it. Had a couple misconceptions, but as uh, I finally explained to him that this means that you're going to be telling others that you want to follow Jesus Christ as your Savior, that you want others to know that testimony of you. I said, now think about it, and uh, let me or your mom know tomorrow uh, what you're thinking about this. And Margie said that the next morning he got up and he just said, it's yes. And so uh, <laughs> he uh, definitely made that decision that he wants others to know that uh, he's following Christ. So Scott, today, are you trusting in Christ alone as your Savior? No. Not trusting in any works, but trusting in him alone? Yes. Amen. All right. Then on the profession of your faith, my brother. I baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, buried with him by baptism into death, and raised with him to walk in newness of life. Amen. And all God's people said, Amen. Amen.